Hello everyone, Praise Good here, and welcome back to more Legend of Zelda, Twilight Princess. I'm lost in a cave. Also, I'm lost in a cave with this, which is something I can't do anything with, so we're gonna just leave it be. Again, that's something that we'll get more access to later on, but we can't do anything with right now. So, already, scooter and editing. I'm gonna need you to wake up and write yourself, write, write a note. In fact, get yourself a notepad, scooter and editing. I, I mean, desktop. Because I've got to write down notes of things I have to go back to. I have to go back to the thing in Goron Mines for a treasure chest later. And now I have to come back to this cave much later for something else that we haven't even been taught about yet. But we've seen two of. Anyway, last time. We did a, bu we been a, did a bunch of side quests around the area of Kakriko Village. And we got bombs, so we started exploring this place. And now... Hi, how's it going? You know, that works. Oh, hey, I did the cool thing. I wasn't even trying to do that. But hey, I showed an action. You can actually do the cool sword swish swash thing. That's an O? That's an A, my guy. Man. Although you see that, and I, you, I see that and I go, you know, the bad thing is, I'm pretty sure with how terrible... Bull. My... Penmanship is that could be a way right now. Is anybody else seeing this? Okay, so I'm not crazy. But anyway, this is uh oh shoot, that was a lantern that was lantern oil. So yeah, uh there are chews in this game which will I will spoil, we'll get introduced to them more intimately? Intimately is not the right word, but I'm gonna use it as a word. We'll get introduced to the choo to Choo Choo's a little more intimately later on. But there are several types of Choo Choo's. And if you get a yellow one, it's lantern oil that you can use. So you don't have to buy your lantern oil if you find a yellow Choo Choo. Anyway. Now with that all done. Let's go blow up that last rock out there. Uh, well I'm gonna need my bombs to blow, to blow up rocks, right? I know what a bomb is. God damn profit. Epona. It's a small slope. Thank you. Anyway, I'm gonna blow up this last rock. But yeah, it's just... Oh my god, I'm, I'm godlike. Did I just pull that into... I think I just pulled that inside of the rock. Okay. Well, I just, ex I just learned how to do fast bombs, I think. But yeah, so that was it. That was our little exploration uh, to the to the west and we've already done all the bugs out here so I should get my bug guide up because we're about to go to a whole new area good job Epona and in fact while that while we're moseying through Kakariko village I think I will do it sorry it's really hard to do two things at once Technically, like, five things at once. Oh, sorry, chicken. Now, I don't think there is anything we can do back on... Back on... Uh, oh, God. Sorry, Pona. I literally threw your face into that. Okay. Stop. About face. And let's try again. No wild movements on the sticks. There we go. So, yeah. Now we're going to want to go north. I believe this is going to be referred to as the Laneru Providence. Ah, yeah. uh, Pyro Field. Okay. Now as we come out here, we're going to want to stop and take, take note of things. First things first. I see that up there, so I'm going to take a minute. Uh, shoot fast, by the way. As we go start out here, we're gonna want to take a minute just to blow some things up. I believe that's something else we can blow up. But I don't think we can do everything out here. Yeah, because there's that over there. Actually, there's stuff we can do back in. There's actually something we can. Do I know you? No. Anyway. Actually, I wonder if it'll get to be nighttime in time. We might go back to Kakariko Village to do the nighttime, some nighttime shopping. Anyway, I think it's something we can actually do back in Orden Village, but now we have bombs. But I think I'm gonna just 
take a pause break on that, on backtracking for now, and kind of go forward, considering I spent the, the basically almost the entirety of last episode and a little bit of this one doing backtracking almost. But I'm going to see what I can do out in this area. I'm a little hesitant to try and go full bore up this cliffside because something tells me I can't do everything out here, but nothing... Nothing's ever stopped me from doing something stubbornly anyway. Uh, let's see. Nothing over there, so that tells me that something I can do would be right here. Ish. Yeah, there it is. Let's see. Oh, I think I see... I think I already see something out here. Ooh, piece of heart. Wow, I have really been raking in the pieces of heart. Reminder, by the way, that I have not played this game in over 10 years, and I'm remembering this. But yeah, I saw that out there. Epona, I'm going to need you to just chill for a minute. Hold on. I'm going to separate out my bombs and my arrows again. Yes, 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 I understand heroes, bow. But yeah, I see this. Uh, let me get my boomerang. No. Boomerang. Bombs. But yeah, opponent will come back for you because this tells me I can actually get a bug. I think that's a grasshopper. Can you get it? Oh, shoot. Okay, hold on. You're scaring it away, Link. Dang it, I missed. Or did I? Uh, oh, there it was. There we go. Yeah, it's a grasshopper. Okay, so we can get grasshoppers out here. Now let me pull up my guide. Alright, so we found the male grasshopper. So, basically over in that direction over there is where I can get the other, grasshop the other grasshopper. But, it is now nighttime. And they said something about a shop at night. And I think there's something we can do at night shopping in Kakariko. So I'm going to take the time already to backtrack to Kakariko and go do that. I'm not going to lie. I'm actually... I remember having so much uh, so much uh, harder time with these grasshoppers and whatnot than I do now because... I guess with the bugs because... I remember never finding them. And then... And then like if I did find them... It was still hard to see because... Oh, boy. Let's see. Across from... Oh, you. Do you sell... Okay, you just sell lantern oil, uh, red potion, blue potion. Now, you'll probably have seen some of those weird lanterns hanging above, hanging above the village. Like we've seen twice now. And, again, that will bleed into something that we'll handle later. We can't handle it now. Later. Not now. Yeah, so that's something we can, well, I guess if you need some uh, emergency supplies, that is now available for you back in Kakariko. But at this point, I want to go handle at least one thing that is currently on my radar. Hi, hi uh, Leavers. So somewhere out in this area. Ignore the wall of twilight, by the way. There's something chasing me? No, it's just my hooves. Oh, I see it already. So right there, that's the other grasshopper. Now, levers, you're going to need to stop. Okay, the, the, the... Heck with it. It's okay, Epona. Just... Epona, you'll be fine. What are you doing? Okay, fine. Stay away from me then. Okay, now we got that handled. Do it. Do do the dance again. Oh shoot! I ran. I yeah. I I lost it. Where is it? I'm gonna get this grasshopper. Got it. 
I guess that's another way you can do it. There. I, we now have... We basically have both of the... Uh, I guess this place is still called the Elden Providence. But yeah, that's it. That's what that's the other thing I wanted to do. I just wanted to make sure I got both bugs out here in the uh, Elden Providence. So I think at this point, actually there is one other thing we can do. Actually, there is one other set of bugs we can get at this point. I I remember this from mainly from seeing others play the game at this point. But there is bugs we can get here. Oh my god, levers, please. Yep, and I see it right now. So I'm gonna... Okay, you're not dead. Get up. Man, I don't think you need the headshot, Link, but okay. Okay. Now I'm gonna take a minute and come up here. Uh, okay. You know, this is fine. Come here, my friend. Hey, look! A phasmid! Also known as a stick bug. Uh, memes upon memes, my friends. Alright, now I gotta go through my miss. I think the phasmid is probably one of the easiest ones to get. Yeah, one is on this side, and the other, I think I already see it, actually. Unless that's something else. So we got one phasmid down there. The other one is... Up here, that is it. I see it. It's on the wall. Also, there's a bomb spot here. Also, that's a cave. Well, as, when the, as the Romans do. I don't know what the Romans do, but they do it. Anyway, I'm just going to make sure I'm... Really? I'm not close enough? Well, hold on. Let me jaunt over this. Can I, I can hit that. Come on. I can... I can hit that. Yeah, I can hit that. Come here, other phasmid. How's it going? Man, I'm so good. <laughs> I'm so good at vigigrams. Let's see. So I think that's actually all the bugs we can get up to this point. Uh, barring anything I'm forgetting. But anything else we can do up here in this area, we can't do for some time because we need more equipment. So, yeah, we're pretty much done in this part of the world. Throw a bomb and hang a left. You know, I wasn't aware that, I wasn't aware you could throw bombs from Epona. But after just three bombs, I've learned to do that. Oh no. Well, here's an interesting th development. Now you could handle this later on when you have something else available to you, but I will recommend that you take care of this now. But we're basically locked to this area of Hyrule for the time being. Basically, it's three Shadow Beasts. But go ahead and take the time to defeat them all at once, if possible. Cause hey, it's gonna make a it's gonna make a warp that you'll use later. Um, but we won't be able to util fully utilize that warp until much later. Hey, Pona, how's it going? Well, Pona, we live here now. I feel like there's something I could have done on that side. And unfortunately, for a little while, we are like I said, we are locked to this location in Hyrule. So I hope there's nothing you really wanted to take care of. And that shop at night in Kakariko with the Goron Child is probably your last major refill spot for uh, a bit. I want to say it's going to be a bit before you can refill again. But anyway, let's just make our way north. And let's slow down. Because... Oh, shoot. You know what? No, we're having a conversation now. Discussions involving your face and my sword. Now I want to say there is something we can do here. I don't know if the bomb is the way to do it or if it's not something we must wait for plot. We must wait for plot. 
So don't worry, that is something we can do, but plot is plot will direct us to take care of that at some point. And oh. Well, Epona. We're gonna part ways for a little bit, Epona. Uh don't do anything I wouldn't do. Uh don't touch my cactus juice while I'm gone. I like how that's my final goodbyes to Epona for some time. Don't touch my cactus juice. Yeah, we're finally here. There's only one few shadow left. So this is the last of the twilight you'll see, I guess. Whether you, whether or not you accomplish your final task and survive, survive is up to you. So what will you do? I will enter the twilight realm. Listen. Can, can you just be a little more sensitive about this time? I understand you have to do what you have to do, but come on. Want me to let you into the twilight? Yes, just be a little more sensitive, please. Oh, to daddy! What? Uh, you, you heard nothing. You heard nothing. Nope, nope, definitely didn't say harder, daddy. Nope. I, 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 there's some things I have to say where I have to take a, where I have to take a very pregnant pause and go, did I really just say those words? And then confirm with myself, yep, I did just say those words. And I regret everything. Alright then, I guess I'll have to help you. But what a shame that this is the last of the twilight. I become so fond of seeing it covering this world. Or is it really the last you'll see? So, shall we get going? <sighs> Sure, I, I hear things. Nope, I I hear things. I hear these bats. Come here, come here. Nah, come here, come here. Puppy, puppy wants a chew toy. Puppy wants a chew toy. Puppy still wants a chew toy. I am something. Okay, let's leave the bats alone. And I'll just dash forward now. Oh, that's something very important. You know. A very pink mi mist is coming off of that. What if I... You know, who does this belong... Oh. But Link, can you pr at least promise me this? Just come home safely. Forget the youth scent and learn a new smell? So, we have acquired the scent of Ilya. Basically, this is our next divining rod for where we need to go now. You smell the girl, don't you? I could have a look in your face. Well, good. It's another clue then. But this scent could be quite old. I wonder if she's still alright. For your sake, she better be. Anyway, I think with that, we're going to call things here. So, next time on Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess, we'll follow this new scent. And see where it leads us on our puppy journeys. I'll see you folks then. Take care.